now we want to register the software. So we're going to right click on the mouse and it's going to open this menu. We're going to select run as administrator. Again, it's going to ask if we want to allow this from an unknown publisher to run, and we do. So put in your password and select yes. Okay, when the software opens, it's going to show you that it is in demo mode, which it will remain in demo mode for 30 days for an evaluation period. But with your Carvrite serial number, you can register this and make it the full version. So we're going to click on register now. This is three acknowledgments just telling you that you should watch the instructional videos and read the manuals available to you. Click next. You're going to select register online now. It's really best to always use the online register process here. Using any of these others creates a lot of complications which ultimately are going to require some level of internet access anyways because we're going to have to send you an email. So really you need to have your computer uh, on the internet uh, during this registration process. Click next. So here is where new customers are going to create their Carvrite customer account. This is your registration account where all of your licensing is going to be stored for all of your patterns and any other pieces of software that you activate to your account. If you are already registered with your machine and then you're just installing this on a new computer or upgraded that computer then you would select that you already have a customer account and you would put in your username and password in these fields. We're going to go ahead and create a new customer account here. Alright, this is the form that you will fill out as a new customer. This is where you create your username and password, which you will need to write down somewhere so that you can remember. The software quick start guide has a place for you to write down your password so that you can remember it later if you need to install on another computer or if you're activating software down the road. Fill out the rest of this information. Down at the bottom, this is where you're going to put in that Carvrite machine serial number. This number identifies this particular machine to your account. Once finished, click Next. So now it's connected to our registration server and it's asking for you to name this particular computer. Examples here like Shop PC or Mary's Laptop. This is just to help differentiate this particular computer from another computer if you call in for support. And click Next. Okay, thank you for registering your Carvrite Designer software. This is where the unlock code will be displayed. This unlock code will be used to unlock your new Carvrite system that you just registered during this process. Write this code down as you'll need it during the unlocking step next. The registration and uh, uh, activation of your software is now complete and you can click finish. Now the software is free for you to use. If you have activations that need to be done, follow the activation video. To unlock your Carvrite, insert the memory card into the card slot and turn the power on. On the screen, you will see displayed, Registration needed, press any key. Press any key, and then when prompted, using the number keypad, type in the unlock code and press enter. Your Carvrite is now unlocked and ready to use.